You had all the famous doctors. We're so honored to have you as our patient. Well, I'm so you've seen... honored to be in your midst here. <laughs> Hey, we have Robert here. Hi, Robert. Hi. How are you doing? Good. How are you? Okay, thanks for allowing us to film you today. He was just in the hospital. He had a little infection here. So you got some little corn here. I'm going to remove those. It looks closed though, right? You had an infection? A little bit of infection? It, 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 yeah, I do. And yeah, yeah. And but it's better? It's, it's, we're working out of it. Okay. So how long your toes been all swollen like this? Um, they have been that way for, um, about a year, and that's why we're moving from Unaboots to a Circade rack. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I have cerebral palsy in my right hand, mm -hmm. and it impedes the ability to crimp, uh, the compression sock. Oh, I see. That's hard to use, huh? And the, and my compression, uh, According to Dr. about 23. Oh, really? Okay. And Dr. Th is an orthopedic guy. Right. That's very famous. I read his books. He's a very famous orthopedic doctor. Yeah. Yeah. So what What? What made your toes become like this swollen though? Well, I, in uh, 2009, I had a bunionectomy. Uh -huh. on that foot right there. Oh, this one, right there. And huh? doctor, the doctor was gonna tend to the fourth, the the index toe, uh -huh. and um, it was, uh, so it was, it was too difficult to, he was gonna uh, straighten both the the big toe and the, and the number four toe. Oh, this one? No. This you mean one. this one, second one, okay. Second one. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So, um, and there's a, uh, I think because of the circulation, because mm. I've got uh, a venal insufficiency. Oh, I see, okay. So you, you knew that. But before that surgery, you didn't have your toes like this? No, they weren't, they weren't like this. Really? Oh, wow. Okay. So. And, and then, when was that? When was that surgery? 2009 oh, oh, in, okay. in August. Oh, okay, about 11 years ago. Okay. It took uh, it took uh, three years for the swelling to go down on my left foot. Oh, is that right? It oh, was, wow. Uh, it was a major with Dr. Uh -huh. Oh, he's the one that did the surgery? You had all the famous doctors. We're so honored to have you as our patient. Well, I'm so, you've so seen... honored to be in your midst here. <laughs> <laughs> and 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 uh, and then according to Batista, uh, we've got to take a gradual thing because right. I have cerebral palsy from the toenails to the top of my head. Everything, huh? It affected you everything, huh? On the on the left hemisphere, which is the right side. Uh huh. Uh huh. And yeah. I had a hypophysial arrest mm -hmm. at, when I was 13 years old, and it basically, uh, I had, the right foot was three and a half inches shorter. Oh, is that right? Oh, than wow. the left one, and it's within a quarter inch to when I was like age 40. Oh, wow. So we did a lot of thinning and, and you know, but, uh, and then I wore, I wore uh, high top um, uh, shoes with the corrective brace on the right foot. Oh, is that right? Oh, you still wear that? Are you still um, wear? I, um, I, I've got, uh, I've got a customized brace mm -hmm. from. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And Dr. Got us, got uh, uh, Reichel and I situated mm -hmm. um, with him, and we we had to move from human design, so mm -hmm. we lost uh, we lost about a half a year or so. Oh, is that right? With the treatment with all the stuff, and change and stuff, huh? Yeah, and, yeah. And it's,
So does does oh your toes swell more than uh, more than right now, or is this kind of the this maximum? This is kind of this is big time. Oh, this is the maximum. Yeah. That doesn't get much bigger than the and toes then right now. When I go to the circade wrap, it'll uh -huh. it'll take the pressure off the toes. Uh -huh. And then I'll be able to show up in Hollywood for. Oh yeah. Okay. You know, I mean. So the Walk of Fame. <laughs> <laughs> the Walk of Fame, right? You know, I'll, I'll get my star. And, you get your star, right? And then yeah. I'll be able to put defeat in the... No, anyhow. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, this toe is not really infected, but I think you need to put some medicine there, okay? I'm just cleaning it all out. Well, yeah, and then, and then um, what I do is I clean them every night. Oh, you do? So okay. You know, I, and mm -hmm. uh, you see a difference between the left and the right. The mm -hmm. left I cleaned up, and the right I've got, uh, I've got discolored. Mm -hmm. but I, uh, you mean this one? On the on the second toe. So oh, this one. That's alligator skin. Alligator skin. Do do you soak it off? Do you take some of these skin off there? Yeah, I can, I I I use. Uh, I clean it uh, um, uh, with a Bragg, uh, uh, and five to one Bragg uh, 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 vinegar cider. Yeah, apple cider vinegar. Yeah, and, and, and yeah. It, it's it's it taking helps. the staff and and it improves the circulation if if you uh, if you bathe your entire foot. Uh-huh. Apple cider vinegar, right? Yeah. Yeah, I take apple cider vinegar every morning, first thing in the morning with uh, water, and then the right before I go to sleep. And I'm diabetic, and it controls my diabetes, too. It keeps your sugar level down. Did you know that? Well, yeah. How, how, what do you have, like eight ounces or six Oh, you can't have too much, in, at least in the beginning. Cause it may mess up your stomach, right? Because it's very acidic. But yeah, uh, I I go slow. I I usually have a well. Like I a, may like have a, to go go down that route because what we I had a lower uh, when I came into Batista, I had a lower wound, open hmm. wound down here, and that's why I've got the compression. Right, but it's all healed. That one's all healed. Yeah, I'm trying to take some of the other, but. Yeah, soaking an apple cider vinegar is really good. While you're at it, take some, you know. Just take a, like a teaspoon and okay. mix it with about four ounce water. That's what I do. And it's still, you know, it, 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 I, I feel it on, your, on my stomach still. After years of doing it, you know what I mean? It's never a pleasant experience, but it really helps to repopulate your gut microbiome, especially bacteria. It kills all the bad stuff, right? Yeah. So, yeah, I highly recommend the apple cider vinegar soaks, as well as taking some in the uh, uh, first thing in the morning or right before you go to sleep, or both. I do both because it really helps me, uh, helps my stomach, you know? So I do highly recommend it. No, and I've got to do that because I've got plaque buildup in my, in my, is it arteries or veins? Uh-uh. And so that'll that'll keep that going. Yeah. And, and doctor, too, I have I have taken a load of weight off. I've reduced like 30 pounds. Oh really? Oh, how'd you do it? Well, uh, it's a top secret. Uh, it, uh, basically, it's controlling my what I what I eat. Uh, oh really? And, uh, wow. And, and, through uh, medication that's geared towards uh, the plaque thing and, and sleep apnea, which I have. So I've got, I've got uh, challenges at both ends of my body. <laughs> well, we all do. You're not alone. We're going that direction, but you're doing great. You lost 30 pounds. That's, well, that's awesome. And then I saw, I saw a huge... Uh, I, I, I saw, I went into the pharmacy up in, up in 
now reminds me of the lady that's there. She says, oh, my dear, you, you look a thousand percent better. Really? Yeah, she, because, and, and this is you guys. It isn't, you know, I mean, it's, it looks tough here, mm -hmm. but it's, uh, it's a gradual, as Dr. Batista said, process. Yeah, yeah, it does take time, but... Yeah, we're gonna, uh, I'm gonna put a little band-aid here. You're gonna soak this area. We're gonna put a Uno boot here to keep the swelling down, right? All the way up to here. Yes, yes. So let's take another picture here. And and go up to my kneecaps. Yes, yes. And thanks see for, uh, yeah, thanks for allowing us to film you today. And you can see that I don't, didn't